cases of a mysterious illness that paralyzes children are on the rise. Like five-year-old Hudson Finkel in Illinois, whose arm suddenly fell limp a few weeks ago. He came to me and he is supporting his left arm with his right arm and he says, Mommy, my arm's broke. The Centers for Disease Control is now investigating 127 possible cases of acute flaccid myelitis, or AFM, in 22 states. 62 cases have been confirmed. 90% of the cases are in those less than 18 years of age, so it is primarily a disease of children. AFM can cause muscles and reflexes to weaken suddenly. Doctors have suspected it may be related to a virus, but they've been unable to pin down any one thing linking all of the cases. AFM has peaked every other year since 2014. It's a pattern that has so far stumped public health officials. We're looking really broadly at any possible cause. So we're looking at anything that might be causing the AFM because our earlier investigations haven't revealed the cause. It is scary, but extremely rare. Overall, the rate of AFM since 2014 has been one in a million. Now, the long-term effects of AFM are unknown. Some children recover completely. Others are left with a disability for years. Erica Edwards, NBC News.